Alright, what is up? So, um, back in November, I made a Call of Duty Black Ops 3 honest review. Uh, I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna continue this trend with the honest reviews, uh, with the next three games. Um, these are all out of order, so it doesn't matter when I got these games. So, the first game, as you all know, Just Cause 3, I've been... You know, live streaming or posting videos of uh, Just Cause 3 the past month. Yeah. Uh, I got it February 1st. This game is legit. I just beat it like an hour and a half ago. It, it, it's really good. I like it. It's, uh, if, you, if you're like a Grand Theft Auto fanatic, this is Grand Theft Auto on crack. You can see right there. You can... Wingsuit, parachute, blow stuff up. Everything is destructible. Uh, uh, this is a destructible world. Um, obviously rated M for mature. Blood, violence, language. Obviously. Uh, 43 gigs. Not bad. Um, what else does it come with? It doesn't come with anything. No codes. Uh, yeah. So... You're basically, this is basically a continuation of the last two Just Causes. I played Just Cause 2, I had Just Cause 2 back in the PlayStation 3. Uh, I have an unboxing video of it only, I don't have gameplay of it. Um, because I, I, you know, PlayStation 4 didn't exist, so no live streaming or direct upload to YouTube. So, yeah, uh, continuation, Rico Rodriguez, he's the main character. Uh, basically with these games is you're on a, you're in a country controlled by a dictator, so in this country, it's like a, I don't know, it's a mix between Greece and Italy, Di Ravello is the general, General Di Ravello, aka dictator of the country of, shit, what is the country called? I don't know what the country is called. Anyways, regardless, I, um, Medici. Yeah, he's the dictator of Medici. You have to go with your rebel friends and overthrow the him. So as the story progresses, you take control of bits and pieces of the country. And then... That's just an off branch of the game, so you can do like there's spe uh, specific missions where they specifically go and liberate country or parts of the country, and then there's parts where you can just go and liberate yourself. So like me, I have like 16, 17 states or provinces to liberate still. Um, that's gonna take a while, <laughs> obviously, but I give this a 4.5 out of five. There's a lot, there's some glitches, not glitches, there's some, like, things I don't like. Repetitiveness, sure, it's just cause, it's always repetitive. Um, the grappling mechanics aren't the best. Parachute mechanics, sorry, parachute mechanics, mixed with the grapple, aren't the best. But overall, it's a really good game, I would recommend it. I got this for 50 bucks at GameStop. Uh, I think it's still 50, I don't know. That's it. So, highly recommend. Stay tuned for the next two honest reviews. I'll give you a hint. That's it. Alright guys, see ya.